Alright y'all, so welcome to Lost Eagles. This is a dope mod uh, made for Metal Horse Squad 2, uh, set in an alternate World War II where Operation Overlord, aka D-Day, right? went wrong and all of the paradroppers that uh, we sent in uh, for D-Day uh, were, uh, they failed their mission, so now you say that uh, we're on pretty bad Tell them times to wait. I'll be right there. So Baker is, I guess, the main uh, actor of the story. We were playing this. Um, Baker was a just to try it out. It came out in like 2021, over the top. I think, and uh, I tried it out when it came out before. But I think now we'll go ahead here and try it out again. It recently <laughs> just got a mo uh, an update this uh, this year. I think in actually no, this month in uh, June. It's not this month, but last month it got an update. So this should be really cool, trying out basically the full version of it. I think it has 14 missions when I tried it out the first time. It had like one or two. So it's definitely gotten a lot better since it first came out in 2021. Okay, so we're just going to go and check it out here. This is in honor of uh, July 4th, which is today. So happy birthday, 21. Uh, <laughs> happy birthday, America, it's I guess Baker. what I was you meant to say. Lieutenant Baker, so, this is Corporal Gray. Right. We regrouped with the first squad at Le Bonneville. The Germans tried to attack, but in vain. This village can be well fortified and is not in the ass of the world like that rotten station. In that case, I'll be heading out to the village soon. I want to make sure it's safe enough before I move the wounded out of this hole. What about defense? We started building fortifications out of the wreckage of buildings. At least something will protect us. We'll try to build a small first aid station for Murphy in time. Great. Let's move the wounded to Lebonville out of this shithole until our main forces arrive. We can't stay here too long. This station looks like it's been abandoned since the Great War. It's all rotten and overgrown. And the Dang, smell... The Great War? I've never wanted to vomit like that. Oh. Roger that, sir. We'll try to set up a defense and a first aid point as soon as possible. May I go now? Over. <laughs> May I go yes, now? Corporal. Stand by, I'll be right there. Out. Okay. It makes sense to take a couple of people with you. The three of us would be safer. Alright, so yep. We're allowed to take troopers on raids. Uh, so we can just choose anybody from our little group of people. Uh, but it is determined by this food amount, which, concern we have low food, we're only going to go take a couple of people. Uh, we're going to run over here because they have a bar uh, over here. I think... One of y'all had one, right? Shit, did you see Tommy from Bravo Company get blown up by a mine? I'll be dreaming about that for nope, a long no time. Nope, no BARs over here. I guess it changes? That's kind of weird that it was... This is the longest night of my life. It's kind of weird that it changes, but I guess it's, you know... Sure, how y'all doing over here? I'll just so chillax cool. it. This guy's a bazooka. We're definitely coming over here. There's the guy with the bar. So we'll get the guy with the, uh... AR rifle, Gary Lewis, and I'll get the guy with the uh We're like damn rats in here. Okay. It's only a matter of time before we all get caught and killed. Right, the so last yep. magazine ran out during the landing. We have to visit Turner to fast, stay low. Ourselves. Here's okay. all the extra ammunition we gathered. I hope you can use it. Thanks. How was your leg? Today It still hurts the bitch. The important thing is that it didn't hurt anything Yeah, they don't important. ever give you And anything. I can walk with a limp. Tell Murphy thanks for me. I'd be a lot worse off with a bullet in my leg. Oh, yeah, this? Lieutenant, oh, this I is have right. something for you. From the wreckage of the armored car we destroyed on the way here, Just I was metal. able to get a couple of these gears. I'm sure you could use them. Thank you, Sergeant. Okay. How much ammo does this guy have? None. And all you have is a bazooka. My coat is covered in dirt. It's worth cleaning and improving it by having these gears. Alright. I'm gonna give you a Tommy with some ammo. We doing now, and then you, my friend, are gonna wanna go a couple rounds for MGs here. I think he's taking. He's taking all of this kinda. Yeah, I don't think this is what we wanna do. Well, I guess I is 100. Oops. Alright, it should be fine. There we go, so everyone's been nice and ammoed up. We'll go ahead and draw the holster weapons. 
And then now we have to head over to this workbench, so then we can uh, clean up uh, Jason's pistol. So yeah, this is a super cool mod here. Um, it is set in uh, after uh, the uh, para droppers came in uh, on D Day here. So, something in here. Alright, now this is a spot that I'm not entirely sure what it wants me to do. I put him on this thing. And then. Do I. Nobody told us about it. I don't know how I'm supposed to like do this. Doesn't bother explaining. And then Come once on. he, and once he gets on there, he's uh, fine. All right, well, that's good. That's super. What? Where does pistol go? Where does where is pistol? Go? Oh, one over here. Hold up. I don't know how we're supposed to do this. Alright, whip out the pistol. Great. And then, I guess maybe sit down there with the pistol? Oh, over here. The toy. Alright, there's our corp. And then we can install fire rates. We can do more damage. We can give it a silencer. We can close it right Six go so I don't have enough for any of this. All I have to do is I, all I can do is the fire rate. So I guess we're doing the fire rate. I wish it would be like a really cool, like if there would be a really like a visual effect on the cold, that'd be cool. I'm not sure there is. We're gonna leave. <laughs> there goes the cold. Get ready. That, that was the problem. Hmm. What's that sheet on the wood? What sheet? He did tire you hear me. Alright. My abandoned service stations. Unbaker's inventory. Alright, so I guess we have to go pick it up first. Oh, this is like just this is like the start of it. Alright, so I just recently arrived here along with my platoon. We are very fortunate to be assigned to the station and to my sound. Alright, so I'll let you guys go ahead and read this here. Uh, yeah. Okay, well, I went ahead and read that. Just because I say I wanted to read it still. But there we go. So you read the diary entry. That's pretty cool. Interesting. In 1914, there was a frog eater's base here. Yes, sir. I should ask Murphy how much more time he needs to get the wounded on their feet and if there is anything he can do to help. Okay, so a uh, Murphy, my boy, is over here. Bro doesn't have a helmet. His hands are also covered in blood. Eh? Marked by a lot like in the name. Kyle. Conversation. Sir Baker. Conversation. Talk. How he's feeling. Uh, additional tasks that is passed. Okay. Uh, Honestly, I'm very friend? worried about the survival of our guys. I doubt that any of the wounded will survive at all, as I have absolutely no medical instruments. For fun. Yeah. No. <laughs> he said what I said. All right. Well. Uh. Okay. Am I supposed to? Additional tasks. So Sir, this one. a few of the guys tore their personal belongings into rags, so we'd have some bandages to help the wounded. Bandages are what the wounded are critically needed right now. Would you help us get them? Hey, yeah. So this uh, manicure, it wants he wants us to get some bandages for the wounded. So I think really like we have to go. Uh, so if I decline, then we can just get straight to the task, or if we click accept, Thank you then we'll do this. I'll just Lieutenant do this. Baker. Yeah, no problem. Alright. Five Murthy, ten bandages. Everything is ready. Time We're ready to, to go. Ready. Get ready. Going to with a squad. So there's squad, resupply, improve your weapons, and there's no quest. 
that's gonna rest the left hand side is this. This is the Okay. Two difficulties are to choose survive on ground and one playing on the ground level. My resistance will be markedly reduced. In addition, the character resistance will be increased. If I can have experience here, the mechanics of lost eagles. You know, we're playing on survival uh, because this one a nice, easy uh, game, not too worried about what's going to happen. So I guess we can go on a raid. We don't have everything else that we could do, so we might as well just head out. Alright, the guard is going to open up that block like that would do God literally you, anything. Guys. Thanks. <laughs> Henry Turner. He's chilling out at the front of the base. Because the little roadblock is so, obviously going to help. So you didn't say what our task is. Our task is, it's to uh... Oh yeah, something. remember Corporal Gray? Remember Gray? Gray, is that the coward from the second squad? Coward, oh. Look, it's not like he's a coward. Back there in Sicily, some shit happened while landing, and he's not himself after it. You wouldn't want to be in his shoes. I sent Corporal Gray and his squad into the neighborhood sectors to find a better place for the injured. They have contacted us from the Labonneville village, and they are already preparing a defense within first aid station there. Nice. That's great. This station is fucking creeping me out. <laughs> It's yeah, me too. Out. Not the nicest place, especially the sanitary conditions. I don't wonder why this place wasn't on the map. Let's move the wounded over there and then we'll see. I'm sure we'll find more survivors. I'm glad the situation is stabilizing. The day after tomorrow we'll already be in the rear area. I mean ours. I hope so. I hope. Huh, <laughs> I hope. Those are good chains actors. Oh, there we go. You get the nice little title screen. Yay. And it's two. It's day one. Screenshot. That's gonna be the thumbnail, baby. <laughs> All right, y'all. It's snowing. What? My squad went on a raid. <laughs> Did it? <laughs> Did it go on the raid? All right. Well, I guess we're gonna click next. Okay. Next feature is free. So, day one, 5:20 a.m. One of them, uh, eleven kilometers from Saint Mare, Iglesias. 